Hey everybody, it's about time I made this video. I've been meaning to for fucking ages. Did you watch my vlog? Did you watch my vlogs from Prague? No. Did you watch my vlogs from Prague the last time I went there and I talked about all this jingly jewelry that I had on and that I would make a video about that and that I still haven't? Well, I'm, I'm going to right now. Most of my jewelry comes from all over the place, from all different brands, random places, random shops, uh, random artists. In some instances, I have many pieces from the same person or place. Today, I'm going to talk about the beautiful jingly jewellery that you often see me wearing. When I first saw it spring into existence I was very excited and knew I had to own some and I'm very happy now that I do. Not 100% sure if this is what I should be calling it but um, the brand is Wonderland MC. It's a brand based in Monaco I believe and I think it might be a one person business. I mean I'm not completely sure about that but to the best of my knowledge it's a one person business. I'll link it below for you to the Etsy shop. There's, a, there's also like another online shop but the Etsy shop I found is much easier to navigate than the other online store because it's uh, completely in French <laughs> and the Etsy stuff has like categories and it's a little bit easier to find your way around. Okay, if you hear any weird noises behind me, it's Moon Moon. She makes weird noises when she washes herself, so it's kind of, yeah. What Wonderland MC does is they take these kind of ethnic or tribal style of jewellery and combine it with Western or other kinds of spiritualism. Uh, well, that's, that's the best way I can describe it anyway. So you get this kind of nice sort of ethnic style jewellery but also with like pentagrams and Egyptian symbols and crosses. I think it's a really cool combination, I think it works together really well, it fits perfectly to the style like tribal goth or gypsy goth, it's a thing. <laughs> that style of jewellery is pretty popular within the goth community and I think this is a good place to get some stuff that's kind of a bit unique, a piece that not necessarily everyone's going to have because I don't no, but I've never seen two of these pieces exactly the same. They always seem to be like a little bit different. So I'll show you the things that I have and I'll link to the shop, but I won't be able to link you to the exact item because I think you'd be lucky to find the same piece twice. <laughs> There's always, there'll be similar pieces, but there'll be like a link, be a little, bit, little difference between them. I don't know. Um, I mean, maybe that's not the case, but I'll go have a look. Just go have a look. And if you see something you like, it's probably better to get it sooner rather than later, just in case somebody else does and that particular item never comes back. Anyway, I'll show you the pieces I have. You've seen me wearing almost all of them before. You've definitely seen me wear this one. I love this necklace. And they were being sent to me. I thought this one was going to be my favourite. I think it might be my second favourite. But I fucking love this. It's so cool. And also on me at the moment is an earring. I would, you know, obviously there's a pair of them, but you can't see my other ear, so there's no point wearing both. Here's the other one, just to show you. Excuse my undone nails. I'm learning guitar. They're going to be a bit short and rough for a bit. But yeah, I thought these earrings were awesome. They're nice and big and dangly, and they match this Moon Moon! I love great big impressive earrings. These are not the biggest ones I'm going to show you, but they are pretty cool. They match nicely with this necklace because they've both got pentagrams on. You can have like a matching set. So that's one set there. One that you haven't seen me wearing yet is this necklace here. Uh, it's a little bit different again. There's so much to look at in each one of these. So I'll show you what this one looks like on as well. I feel like every time I look at them, I discover like another bead or another symbol or something tied on. You know, I think this necklace might also match these earrings. Like I said, there's so much going on. I feel like maybe those two could match because see that? These two things look kind of similar, don't they? I reckon. You've definitely seen me wear my favorite piece before. If you watch my vlogs from the Mera Luna Festival, I was wearing it there. Um, I wore this piece in a recent video. The Kat Von D Beauty Saint and Sinner palette video recently. I had this on. A little bit different. This one's made of lace with like copper doodads attached to it. I really like the pendant on it. This upside down Jesus with some spikes. And what's even more awesome is that this one has earrings that match absolutely perfectly. These earrings are so cool. I wish I had lots of earrings with feathers on them. Look! See what I mean? They match exactly to each other. My favourite earrings from Wonderland MC definitely these ones they are massive because I've got such big hair and unless I have my like death hawk up you can only see one ear so I think it's it's nice to have like a lot of earrings or like a lot of big earrings like the dangly ones that's my that's my jam have a look at this this is really cool these are immense they're so impressive if you like big statement jewelry as it is known but my favorite piece I have on this stand over here I like to display my jewelry like you would in a shop because then you can kind of 
walk in and see everything all presented nicely. I'd rather do that. I think if you're going to own nice things, it's also nice to be able to display and present them nicely at home. This necklace immediately became my favourite as soon as I got it. It's so fucking cool. It's just this giant statement necklace again with like so much stuff going on. Like I said, I've already worn this quite a lot, like I've worn it to festivals. If you're not sure what to wear and you want lots of bling, Bam, one necklace, sorted. These sorts of things are also good for layering, so like maybe this just goes to here, but I could put more chains around my neck that would hang down further with maybe some more doodads hanging off. I think that looks nice. I will eventually do a jewelry collection video. It's kind of part of my wardrobe tour that I've been doing in pieces over like the last year or however long it's been. Eventually I will do a jewelry collection video, but I may also do one or two others for like my favorite jewelry brands that I have like many pieces from. But I just wanted to share these ones with you because I thought they were super cool and just something a little bit different that you won't find everywhere. So, like I said, I will link below to the Etsy shop where you can find these. I think the only negative thing I have to say about this brand is that these things are quite delicate. For example, I've had a couple of little coins come off, so you have to be pretty careful because, you know, they can... little pieces can come off and you just, just, just be gentle with them. I do treasure them and I try to take good care of them, but you know, when you're, when you're at festivals and taking things in and out of bags, it can be a little bit harder to be very careful with your delicate stuff. Otherwise I think these things come at a reasonable price and they are really beautiful and cool and unique. Um, thank you very much for joining me. I hope you've had a super week. Uh, which one of these necklaces was your favourite or earrings? What, which thing did you like the best? Because yeah, like I said, I fucking love this, but I think the great big one is my it's my number one favourite. And I eventually do a tour of this room when it is less chaotic in here, like you can't see but there's a lot of stuff around that doesn't, I don't know where to put it, like bags and boxes and stuff will get there eventually. Um, but I do like to keep these all hung up and displayed beautifully so I can look at them all at once. As always, take care of yourselves, be nice to each other and I will see you next time. Bye!